Athletes and activism have been connected since the earliest sporting events. More athletes, black, brown, white, etc., are now speaking out and using our voice. Panels like these are the reasons why the voices are being uplifted. You know, I've been very vocal about things that I recognize as wrong. And I feel like everyone has that same ability. It should be in the paper. It should be in the black and white about what we do to allow people to unmute and speak openly. We can't allow this to happen to us because it happened to one man, but it happened to the human race. Ableism is rooted in racism. It's inspiring. I'm not here to inspire you. I'm here to do my job. I'm here to be myself and do what I'm here to do, you know? I did not want to change the dynamic of, of, of my relationship with my sport, so I took myself out of it. Our teams were very, very fragmented when it came to racial issues. No amount of money that we've made has disconnected us from the communities that we've come up in. I'm just grateful, grateful for the journey. For a lot of young people, you know, sports is, is where they get their confidence. But let's teach them about the gift that is sports and all of that it brings you in terms of just learning how to be a great teammate, celebrate others. That is um, really the light that guides this program is looking back at history and seeing the places and the spaces where athletes were able to make a difference. To understand, I have to channel this for, for a greater cause, for a greater good. When you have a platform um, and you build it, now you, now you start to figure out how powerful it is and what you can actually accomplish.